space. One of the most intriguing concepts to date. The seemingly infinite abyss filled with countless amounts of fish. Is this not about space? No. This is Ancestors to Humankind Odyssey, a game where you can evolve into the creature of your dreams. Yeah. Or, you know, at least one with facial hair. First, we need a name for our new species, so we'll go to the greatest website for deciding names on the internet, Wikipedia. Now, some of you might be asking, Wikipedia is not a name generator, you undeveloped primate. So let me show you how it's done. You just click on random article and then you get a great name for your child, such as list of Lebanese people in Bulgaria. See? A perfect name for your child. So perfect that I would not dare to take that name for my species. So I guess we'll have to go again. Yokohama International Swimming Pool. Okay. Since there's a limit of 15 characters to the name, I guess we'll just have to settle for Yokohama. Pool. Player help. Hmm. Since it's my first time ever playing this game, I think the right thing to do would be... Yeah, that seems about right. Now let's start our Ancestors to Humankind Odyssey. Hey, that's me! <laughs> Sorry, can we get an instant replay on that? Nice. Okay, so I found a fish and apparently I don't want to share, so now I'm just looking for a place to have lunch alone. Relatable. Yeah, look at me, look at all that beautiful hair and stuff. No, no, help me, save me, make it stop, delete my hard drive. I am now a child, and apparently I'm either hallucinating or this is a very scary forest. What am I supposed to do? The only thing that happened was that I got bitten by a snake, so now I'm slowly reaching my demise. I am starting to think that I made a mistake in picking the option without help. Yeah, let me just quickly... Wow, magically all kinds of magical instructions appeared. Wow. Alright, so I need to find the small monkey from the beginning that is lost somewhere. And of course I don't want to go alone into the dangerous jungle. That would be crazy. So I'm taking a child with me. Grabbing foliage and creepers. Jump and hold spacebar. Okay, that sounds very doable. Oh, hey, I'm all the way back here. Oh, hey, this is the hiding spot from earlier. Bruh. Thank you for saving me. I cannot wait to reunite with my family. Uh, you're adopted. Ah, home sweet home. After a long day of babysitting, I can finally turn off my brain and relax. Is the child at the front okay? So, what am I supposed to do now? Hi sisters, welcome to another DIY tutorial on how to stay alive, naked and afraid in the jungle. Before we begin, there's a small thing you want to do as preparation. Preparation. One of your arms apparently doesn't work, so you should probably get that checked out. Now that we can use both hands, we can get to the crafting. So let's say it together, let's start dying. Me stone stone, me sniff stone, me more stone stone, me sniff more stone, me stick me stone, me stone more stone, me sniff me stone more stone, me stone you. That was it for the tutorial of today. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like and subscribe, and then I'll see you in the next video. Cut. Nice job, Bill. <sighs> I hate my life. I have returned to my true form. 
No longer shall I be shackled by the boundaries of this modern society. No longer will I be a subject under the strict hierarchy formed by our ancestors, where my parents have authority over me under the disguise of parental obligations. No longer shall I... Please take me back. Objective, form a couple. Male, single. Relatable. Hey there, girl. Are you here often? You got some dirt on your back, I see. Do you want me to eat it off? Now that we've had our first date, I think we are ready for the next step in our relationship. Children. Close your eyes, son. That was fast. Relatable. Now we never have to worry about going into danger alone. Next objective, identify the hidden water oasis. Ah yes, we have finally discovered the place we have been living at for 2 years and 189 days. What is happening? They say that when the end is near, time slows down. Your life flashes before your eyes. Sadly, I have not yet developed my memory enough to look back and appreciate the beauty of my life. But I guess this is it. Farewell, everyone. There's an afterlife. I hope to see you there. Is that it? I guess we'll inspect it then? Now that we have weapons and the finest armor in town, we are ready. A nice and easy life hack is that you can eat leaves to protect yourself from fall damage. Of course, it's very rare for someone of my gamer skill level to fall, but it's just in case. Well, mistakes can happen, of course. Luckily, we can immediately replenish it, but I doubt that it will happen again. You know what? I don't need the protection. I just need to not fall. How hard can that be? Oh, for f At last, I see the light. Is this the end after all? No. I cannot give up now. The comet is right there. All I have to do is take these last simple steps. Why? First, we should try to get rid of our fear of the unknown by going towards that blue light. Now we just have to scare away the beefy boy downstairs with my masterful intimidation tactics. Panic! Okay, at least we now know that the crocodile is way too scary for my clan members to even be close to it. What? I guess that means it's safe. What just happened? At least we're alive. It seems like I need more training. We no longer have anything to fear because I created an army. Let's go. We have the spearmen. We have the juggernauts. We have these things. It is time for the battle of the century. Is it just not going to attack why i spent hours training for this well we don't want the training going to waste so the hog shall be our sacrifice I think it's time for a time skip. 
for the age of a new generation, for new hopes and dreams to form, and for the next in line to pursue their happiness. Well, that's a lovely welcome. You know what? I don't like this generation. I want to evolve. Now, I could do a bit here about how I'm going to evolve like a Pokemon with the classic evolution sounds, but I'm not going to do that because that would be way too easy. So instead, we'll go with Digimon. I have progressed a lot. Things will have changed. I wonder what my next form looks like. Exactly the same.